today is the 5th of February and I'm taking a look at the Euro New Zealand dollar on a monthly time frame using Student Education's FX Ultimate Strategy. What we can see by our matrix box, it is predominantly red and price is trading below the 200 day moving average on all time frames except for the weekly. We're starting to see a few blue arrows coming in intraday which means we could be getting a little bit of a pullback in that long term downward trend. Looking here at the monthly, we've got a red arrow red candle, RMO has just gone red, and RCMA is red and bright. So the strategy is starting to sell up more showing in terms of that negativity. Price is below the 20 and the 200 day moving average and below that monthly central pivot. We do have the 50 day moving average which could act as a support going forward. So now we drop down onto the weekly, we're wanting to see where that 200 day moving average lies. It is trading higher than the 50 day moving average that we saw there on the monthly so we will move up our support level to that we've got a red arrow a blue candle rmo is blue osave is red and bright so the strategy is not set up we've got two red and two blue but we're starting to see more negativity coming in more negative momentum and the current weekly candle trading lower than that previous week's close so when we drop down onto daily what we're looking for is those continuations to the downside looking at the monthly S1 and weekly 200 day moving average as the next major target going forwards. Here on the daily we've got a red arrow, red candle, RMO is red, RCMA red and dark showing a slowdown in momentum. We're seeing a bit of consolidation to the underside of this current weekly central pivot here and therefore I'm setting a daily alert on this pair. I'm looking for a daily breakout to the downside lower than this consolidation or the swing that we've seen. And then what we could do is look to target either that next support level and ultimately the monthly S1. So a daily close lower than the current daily swing with momentum behind us. And we could be looking for daily or intraday trades from Wednesday onwards to the downside on this pair.